Reptiles are one of the major branches of evolution of living beings. They belong to the animal kingdom and appear in the Carboniferous period. They are terrestrial vertebrates that can breathe with their lungs and through the skin. They are ectoderms. They use certain strategies to optimize their body temperature because they are cold blood animals. That's why many of them spend the winter dormant. They have dry, thick and flaky skin that avoids desiccation, internal fertilization and an amniotic egg production. Many reptiles renew their skin periodically. They have short or side limbs or lack of them. They have double circulation, their heart has two atria and one ventricle with one or two cavities. They reproduce by eggs but don't hatch due to internal fertilization. The Komodo dragon is adapted to warm and dry environments. It lives in large and open meadows with tall grass. They can also live in tropical forests and sometimes they live in places like beaches or places near rivers. The smallest Komodo dragons live in groves. Komodo dragon is usually located in Indonesia and in the center islands of Indonesia. The Komodo dragon or Komodo baranid is a species of the Sauropoda family of baranids. It is considered a threatened species due to human activities. That's why the Komodo National Park was created in 1980 to preserve them. It is a predator of the ecosystem in which they live. They feed mainly on carrion but they also hunt, especially invertebrates, birds and mammals. Their mating season is between July and August. Also, they can reproduce by parthenogenesis, a process in which females may lay eggs in the absence of males. The eggs are deposited in September. They lay about 20 eggs and are incubated for 7 months until they open in April. The small Komodo dragons are green with yellow and black areas, while adults have brown or gray skin. In both ages, they have broad scales. It is considered the largest lizard of the world. It measures 2 to 3 meters and weighs about 70 kilograms. Its long and strong tail is very important for the dragon. Moreover, they have a long and yellow tongue.